Hey, great morning. Let's get to the spirit read of the day. What is the topic today? I never know what they're going to give me. Okay, first card out is about guidance and empowerment. Guidance and empowerment. This is one that people are always looking for. Empowerment in their lives, how to uh, make things better, how to uh, navigate through life. How to get guidance, how to, to, you know, go through it. So guidance gives you extra resources. Okay. One of the resources we have is guidance. If we open ourselves up and we want guidance from the divine is, then that will come. That will come. Now, it's not always what people want it to be, okay? Um, it's not always simple, not always easy, but it is there. Okay, about empowerment. Okay, first thing we have is about collaborate. If you want empowerment, then you collaborate. You collaborate, you, you again, open up to the divine is, collaborate with your guides, with those on the other side that want to aid you in moving forward. Okay, let's get our last cards here. We'll just go ahead and use these. Ruffle shuffle and see what the other thing it's going to point us towards. Okay, so for guidance and resources, yeah, these are things that we have always available, available to us to aid us in our journey through this world. This is the world of difficulties. This is school. It's not meant to be easy breezy. It's meant to come with challenges. We come in this plane of existence to go through, to learn, to, to challenge ourselves, to learn things. Okay. So empowerment and collaboration, you know, you have to seek, you have to question and and you don't demand it from the universe. You don't come with this thing, you know, and I've had people that want to be students come and demand because they want it. I need to give it to them. Well, no, that's not the way it works. No spiritual teacher needs to work with people when they come with that kind of attitude, okay? When you come to the universe, you know, you come with gratitude and willingness to hear, okay? People that are coming with this attitude of, you need to give it to me, they're coming out of ego. And, you know, the universe does not give the best to those coming in ego. Those that are coming in ego and demanding and they want powers, they want, that's the things they're looking for. They're not looking for the divine is. They're not looking to know God. They're not looking to surrender. Okay. They get involved in the dark things for empowerment because they want control. Okay. So the path you know, if you want genuine guidance, you want those resources, you want to know the hidden things, you want true empowerment, is knowing that the universe has got your back. True empowerment is being willing to aid others, coming from love. That's true empowerment. Whereas on the other side, that dark side, they want empowerment. It's about subjugation, sub, you know, subjecting others to, to their will, okay? It's about putting down subjugation. And true empowerment is about liberating, freeing up others. So that's where you have the positive and the negative. Those that are on the ego path, 
They want to subjugate, dominate others for their own benefit. Those that are of the light go through love. They want to see people flourish. They want to see others grow. They want to see, you know, they're happy for another's happiness. Okay. So again, what is the exchange? You have to collaborate with the divine is. You can't demand. And I see that so many times people come demanding attitude. Okay. This is what I want. This is what you're going to give me. Okay. God is not your slave. <clears throat> Let me say that again. God is not your slave where you come and you're demanding this and demanding that. You come in gratitude. Okay. Surrender. Not my will, but thy will be done. Okay. Christ didn't come demanding. He said, not my will, but the will of God, the will of light. Not coming from ego. It's not about my ego, what my ego may want. It's about the truth, the higher things, the light. That's how you get, if you want true guidance to aid you within the world journey, then you seek the empowerment out of love. Collaborate with the divine is and seek and be grateful for whatever is given, okay? So that's true empowerment. True empowerment comes when you have that peace that passes understanding, when you have that settledness, that groundedness, that balance in one's life. When one has left fear mode, okay, and all the things that that carries with it, when one has left that, okay, then one is truly empowered, okay? Empowerment is not about gaining power over another. It's about that power of being in alignment with that divine is, okay? Not my will, but thine be done, okay? So thanks for tuning in. Much love and light, and I'll see you on line.